Hello, this is Mike, and I'm here with uh, Diecast Mafia Challenge to customize the Mercedes. And I used this casting. Uh, not in this color, though. But uh, I had a bunch. I had collected up a bunch of these for the wheels. Yeah, my favorite wheels. And so, anyhow, I started out with a red one, and I cut it wrong. <laughs> yeah, I cut it wrong. I was gonna uh, custom, you know, build something special. But since I cut it wrong, I went ahead and cut this much off of it. After I had cut it wrong, I went ahead and cut these pieces off. And I put it back together. And here's what we got after I put it back together. A two-door Mercedes. It's rough looking, but... uh. Anywho, that's uh, what we got there on that one. And I'll probably pass this on to Cat. I uh, saved my favorite wheels from it, and I put these wheels on it. I thought about, I thought about uh, you know, using some of this red on, on the wheels, but this is fingernail polish, by the way. It's, uh, it's all I had. <laughs> I am no painter. Yeah, I am not a painter. But anyhow, that's that one. That will go to Cat. 2A HD Cat. So anyway, I got an I took another red one and I figured out how to cut it right. And uh, excuse me. And so anyway, I was going to uh I got to looking, and I thought I had enough red ones, but I didn't. So I was I was going to take a silver one and use part of a silver one. Well, there's the part. There's the parts. It broke on me. <laughs> yeah. So anyhow, I was gonna uh, I was gonna build a limo, and so anyway, since the silver one broke, I went ahead and I just put the two together. And it wants to roll off because this here ain't level. But anyway, that's what we got there. Uh, I it's kind of hard to explain because uh, I, I painted this one too with fingernail polish. But there's the joint in the middle. I don't know if you can see that or not. And then. You can't hardly tell the joint down the side because, uh, but anyway, I, uh, that's what we got on that. And I was not quite happy with it. So after I got through with this and I started over, yeah, I started over. And as soon as I get this thing set out the way. Here's the final product. I built this. Yeah. That's what I built. Uh, let's move these pieces out the way. Gonna bring it on up here a little closer. Now uh, you'll be able to see where I cut it. And I was filing on it, trying to get it all squared up, and I had the windshields glued in and i messed up and filed on the windshield so kind of messed up the windshield joint but anyway this is three mercedes yeah you can see right there i cut and made the pieces and i went ahead and put my favorite wheels on it yeah it's uh it's not the best in the world, but that's what we got. That dead gum cat in a hat, 2A HD cat, he kept pestering me to join in, so I joined in. Like I said, the only reason I had these Mercedes in my collection was for the wheels. So anyway, 
now that I took all these cars apart, I got five sets of wheels because I used, I, I tore up seven cars. This is three cars and one set of wheels. So there was two extra sets left over. So that'd be one, two. Then I destroyed a silver one, which would be uh, set three. And the red one was two cars. And we got four and five. And then the set of wheels that was off of Shorty, I put on the red one. So that's how I got five sets of wheels out of uh, five sets of wheels. Anywho, that was my diecast mafia challenge build. It ain't much, but uh, that's uh, that's what I wound up with: a two-door, a medium limo, and a super stretch limo. And there's all the pieces left over: two bases, two and a half interiors. There's the fronts off of uh, the front and the rear off of the uh, the uh, two that I cut and made the medium limo there's what's left of the silver one and there's what's left of the black ones yeah maybe i can explain a little bit better see this is uh this is what this is why i should have cut it the very first time was cut it right at the rear wheels and yeah that's uh that was for the you know to for the front half so yeah, I cut it right there, and then the back, the back joint is the original back of the car. I had to do a little filing to square it up, but uh, anywho, and uh, that's uh, that's my uh challenge deal. Uh, I'm probably gonna pass some of these pieces to Mike Espo to go in his junkyard. Yeah, front caps and rear caps for Mercedes. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, I want to thank everybody for watching my crappy video. <laughs> That's uh, it was a challenge, all right, to build this baby. <laughs> but once I figured out how to cut the pieces there, that's uh, turned out fair. I was going to take and uh, I was going to take and put panels in between uh, the uh, between there and there and then there and there, and I didn't. It was it was a little difficult. It wasn't working out for me. I tried making some panels out of M2 plates. So anyway, I want to thank everyone for watching. And we'll catch y'all on another one. This is Mike, and I'm gone.